This tutorial will illustrate the process of collecting materials and generating material reports. The functionality needed for material reports is located within the Output tab's Materials group. The first step in creating material reports is to collect the materials. From the Materials group menu, select Collect. The resulting list allows selecting from which parts of the building the materials will be collected from. Select All to collect the materials from the entire building, and click OK. Everything that has a material code will then be added to this Collected Materials database. This database resides within the respective project folder and will be used later on for generating the material reports. Click OK to save and close the database. To generate a material report, select the Report function, a list of available reports that appears. From here, we can choose from a variety of reports, such as general reports, cutting lists, total lengths of materials, minimum waste cutting, and other miscellaneous reports. For this example, I'll select the Excel cutting list wall frame by code. This report prompts you to select which panels you want to collect the materials from. I will select All and then OK. And now we're looking at a list of the materials that will be applied to the final format. Click OK to proceed. And then our Excel output report will appear on the screen. This report file shows all the wall framing materials grouped by material code. Each section gives you the total length and weight of each material. At the very bottom, we'll get the total weight of all the framing material. If you purchase standard stock lengths for your framing material, then another useful report will be the stock length report. Run the Generate Material Report again and choose the stock steel output. Now we see a report of the standard stock materials that need to be purchased in order to achieve the cut list. The general material reports give a more complete list of materials for the entire building. Here is a report that not only includes the framing material, but also doors, windows, drywall, insulation, sheathing, and anything else that can be either estimated or directly collected from the drawing model pairs.